Friday. This is the Conscious Tinkertist, and it's time for another Friday Flourish. So this week we're going to be doing a variation of a lady's chain. And here's how it looks. This is a simple idea, maybe a little bit more complex than the execution, but in, um, instead of a normal uh, lady's chain twirl where uh, the lead would twirl the lady with his left hand, in this case uh, the lead is going to uh, lead from his right hand instead. Um, great way to signal that is um, uh, move your right hand all the way across your body and show it to your, uh, to your partner over here. Um, make it clear that you're actually doing something different than your normal, uh, than your normal twirl. Um, as she reaches for your hands from here, um, you're just, your body is in a slightly different position to, uh, to do the twirl. Uh, and as you're turning her around, you're turning your body at the same time to follow her twirl. This is a great, uh, a great uh, alternative that you can pull out. Uh, depending on the dance, especially if you're going from a lady's chain into a circle left, or going or a circle right even, uh, or if you're going from a chain into long lines forward and back, anything that involves needing to take the lady's left hand in your right immediately following the, the chain. Uh, uh, with the normal, normal caveats with this, don't twirl anyone that doesn't want to be twirled. Make sure that uh, it's someone that actually uh, doesn't, doesn't have issues with dizziness, doesn't have any shoulder issues if you're going to be uh, giving her some uh, stress across the shoulder as you're giving her some twirls. The other, the other two things to note on this is that actually if you have a men's chain this does work in reverse except for instead of using your right hand to grab his hand you use your left. Principle is the same um, and you still end up where you need to be. Um, the other thing on this is that there's actually an escape mechanism in this because for instance if you if, if you're going to twirl the lady and she gives you the uh, I don't think so and get, instead of pulling in her arm like that what you can do is you can make it into a move bar borrowed from English country dancing and just make it into a gate and back up and she walks forward and you still end up with with the nice smooth feel and also um, you still, have, you still have to switch hands at the end of it. Really go the right way. Exactly. Just like in any normal lady's chain, if you go to twirl uh, the person coming at you and she declines the twirl if she keeps her hand down, never force the issue. She knows what she would like, what she prefers. Go with it. And turning it from a twirl into a gate instead is just a great way to just. Uh, to adapt your dancing to what the person across from you is needing at that moment. Anyway, one more time, the flourish looks like this. This has been the Contra Syncretist. Join us again next time for another Friday Flourish, and submit your own at ContraSyncretist.com or on this YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.